It's hard raising kids. No one tells you how hard it is to do it yourself. It's home last week with my second little girl, helping her do her math homework, math word problems. She's having a hard time. She put a pencil down. She goes, Dad, do I really need to know this stuff? I said, yes, you do, honey. This is the stuff you need to know as an adult. Then I kind of felt like a liar as I was walking away. <laughs> When's the last time anyone's ever called you? Hey, can you pick me up at the train station? Yeah, what time do you get in? Well? <laughs> I leave on a train out of New York City at 3 p.m. <laughs> and that train will be traveling at 60 miles an hour. <laughs> the train also has two stops. A 10 minute stop in Hartford, Connecticut, a 15 minute stop in Providence, Rhode Island. You tell me what time I arrive in Boston. Make sure you show your work before you come pick me up. <laughs> My son forgot his lunch last week. I have to bring it down to school. 8.15 in the morning. I'm not much of a morning person. I go walking in the school. I said, I have a Joe Colleton's lunch. Lady behind the counter goes, okay. What is his teacher's name? <laughs> uh, I have three kids. They seem to rotate a new teacher every year. I'm gonna go out on a limb and say, I have no idea who his teacher is. I was kinda hoping someone would hear would have that information for me. Listen, I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't even care if the kid gets the lunch, okay? You can eat the lunch, she can eat the lunch. Someone can eat the lunch. All I know is I can't bring this brown bag back to the angry woman who sent me down here at 8.15 in the morning. Listen, between me and you, I don't even know if I'm at the right school right now. <laughs> saw some kids, I saw some buses, I took a chance, I came in. <laughs> Please, just take the lunch from me, will you? <laughs> My kids seem smart. They get good grades in school, but I worry about their common sense. This is a perfect example. I'm working a cruise last summer. I was flying out on a Saturday, coming home the next Saturday. We're all having breakfast Saturday morning. So listen, I'm flying out today. I'll be gone for seven days. Make sure you help your mom around the house. Good luck on your sporting events. I'll see you next Saturday. Wednesday, my son calls my cell phone. Hey, Dad, you pick me up over Andrews? <laughs> I said, no, I'm in the middle of the ocean right now. He goes, ah, can you get me later? <laughs> so let me ask you a question. It's Wednesday. You haven't noticed I've been gone since Saturday? <laughs> He goes, oh yeah, is mom with you? <laughs> I'll tell you what, I will pick you up later on. How's that sound? 